Hi folks, Mike the Pan Man, Mike Pugh with Towncraft Cookware here. Thanks again for being with us. Uh, one of the requests we've received on our YouTube videos is how to stack cook. Now with uh, Towncraft, stack cooking is very, very simple. The main thing you want to think about is getting that pan hot, letting it steam. Okay, so each one has to steam before you stack it, but let me give you a few examples. By the way, right now we've got, uh, we're, got we're cooking on it from a uh, pineapple upside down cake in here so that's just sitting there but it could be used to stack too because the 11 inch dome fits our 11 inch skillet also fits our 6 quart dutch oven and our 8 quart dutch oven so there's several ways you can do this okay one one is you can cook inside of your pan uh, several different items all right i'm not cooking tonight with these just to try to show you how to use them this is our 6 quart dutch oven and in here you could start a roast or a meatloaf or something in there, cook it on one side for a few minutes, brown it real good, sear it, flip it over, dump in some potatoes or something like that. Put the utility rack on here. Now the utility rack comes with six cups if you got the basic set. And on the video, the regular video that comes with it, the DVD, you can see you're doing roast and potatoes and carrots and then corn muffins in the six cups that come with that. Uh, on another part of the video, it shows doing meat, loaf, and potatoes using the rack, put corn and peas in our double boiler, and putting that on there so you have a meat and three that way, all right? Uh, but the other thing you want to think about there is just getting them good and hot. So, for instance, if we had a meat, loaf, and potatoes and corn and peas in here, and by the way, many times we've done a roast in here and potatoes, and then put a German chocolate cake in here with some... Um, uh, pecan icing, uh, some of the creamy pecan uh, icing on the on the bottom and then the cake mix in on top, you know, stirred up, of course, and then flip that out. An incredible German chocolate cake cooked with your roast and your potatoes. But uh, get that going, all right, and, and put it to the side. It's on medium, right, until it steams and then turn it to low. Then, of course, here's our uh, nine-inch skillet. Now, this also... Uh, dome lid here also fits our three quart vegetable pan and so you can get anything you want going in there for instance you can get a big uh, big mound of broccoli in there you can get corn and peas side by side or anything like that turn that on get that going get that once it steams you can go ahead and turn it down turn it off as long as this one's steaming also you can stack that one on there okay you know, not something you ever have to do. Some people are afraid of it. I don't know why. It's very, very secure there, okay? And this this right here on top of this gives you as much space uh, as it would on a smaller of the regular older uh, electric stoves, okay? But you can stack. You can get some carrots going in here and stack that one up once it's steamed. So so uh, you've got it stacked up all you want to. Or if you got something big going, you can go ahead and stack this one up there in the two quarts so there's all kinds of ways you can stack matter of fact here's our electric skillet over here on the presentation that I'm presently doing in most homes we're doing a, a chicken in here flipping it over putting some potatoes in on top put the lid on it and when it steams turn it down and then in the nine inch skillet with the dome we've got uh, corn on the cob and broccoli in here and when it steams we stack it up and then we have carrots in here and when it steams, we stack it up, so we've got that whole meal going just like that. Okay, so we're talking about stack heating. It's very, very simple to do, and it is very, very secure. You can see that that is not shaking at all. It is very secure. I've only knocked it over once uh, in all the years I've been with Towncraft, and that was in a tiny, tiny kitchen working with somebody else, and he kind of forced me into the stack, and my elbow knocked the carrots off, but it... All those years, uh, which I've been with the company now over 18 years, and all those years I've only knocked it over once. So it is very secure. It's not something that you have to worry about the kids knocking it off. Of course, we want to be careful. We want to keep that away uh, as far as we can from them, but we're doing that with the stoves now, right? Again, my name is Mike Pugh. You can find me at town. Uh, you can find me at www.mikethepanman.com, just like it sounds. You can find the company at towncraft.net or towncraft.com. And we're easy to find, easy to check out, um, A-plus Better Business Bureau rating nationwide. So call us, let us know, email us, do whatever you want to, get hold of us and let us come see you. God bless you. I hope you're enjoying your town craft. Uh, let us know. We'll try to answer any questions you can. We can.